This is just an update on the DIY Maxim PowerPoint charge controller that I've been designing. I think I may have found a fix for the unstable um, analog digital converters in the microcontroller. Uh, it's just a matter of uh, tweaking the commands that I was using for reading in the um, analog digital converter um, inputs into the um, various variables. And um, having done that, it seems to be a lot more stable. So, because Buffy have been on for a couple minutes now, usually this would have uh, gone crazy by now. Here's the um, better potential uh, gauge lights, or battery charge level gauge lights, and uh, hasn't done that, it's been fairly stable. But I still, though now I need to tweak the specific values as far as what the thresholds are. As well as um, just switch around the resistors that I'm using for... Uh, current limiting for all the various uh, LEDs because the um, this blue one which indicates that the low potential disconnect load is on as well as the white one which has a photovoltaic array or it's um, charging the battery off of a photovoltaic array and the two uh, greeny uh, LEDs are a bit on the bright side although the blue one seems to be the worst offender so we're just going to increase the resistances on them and probably decrease the resistances a bit on the um, red and yellow LEDs, just because they seem kind of on the dim side. Um, so, well, I was pretty much just twiddling around with a uh, decade box and seeing what produces an acceptable brightness and then just putting in um, requisite uh, fixed resistors because I'm not going to put a over half a grand resistor decade box permanently in one of my projects, even if I did get this thing for free. Because I can't afford to get a new one. So, yeah. And this is just the code modifications that I made. Each place where I'm using the analog digital converter, what it is, I just simply set, um, use the 80 con 0 register to set the um, analog input um, multiplexer and didn't start a conversion cycle, so I just simply switched the last two bits in the 80 con 0 register to uh, zeros instead of ones um, and I just use the regular 80 IN statement the 2 refers to the per particular um, analog uh, input channel as did that at every instance of um, where I had an analog where I was I had a statement calling the analog digital converter so now I just need to tweak the values in this if else if end if statement of pain so that the uh, right idiot lights are lighting up at the right times but uh... so far it seems to have improved it a little bit I just need to work on the mechanism for floating the battery because right now it's just this repeat until loop kinda crude but again this is a work in progress what fun